I thank you, Mr. President, for this honor done me. The new ORC will continue to be responsible for the registration and regulation of all types of business entities, companies, incorporated private partnerships, limited partnerships, business names and subsidiary business names, professional bodies. It's also going to keep and maintain a public central register in both manual and electronic form with data on beneficial owners of companies. This is for transparency in business operations. The office is also going to assume the functions of the official liquidator under the Corporate Insolvent Restructuring Act 2020, Act 1015, and its amendments, Act 1031. The ORC would also be the regulator of insolvency practitioners in Ghana through the newly established Insolvency Services Unit. We're also going to set up an official bulletin known as the Companies Bulletin. Additionally, the new office through the Company Inspector Division will embark on several company inspection exercises to inspect the books of registered companies to ensure compliance under Act 992 and undertake massive sensitization and education on the operations of the Act for the general public. The new Companies Act requires that within five years of its coming into force, all operations of the office become completely digitized. It is good to hear that the office has begun this exercise in earnest by ensuring that all records of companies and businesses registered are digitized with the help of a Ghanaian company, Intelligence Card Processing Systems Limited. This is in line with the goal to go completely digital and make the retrieval of records of companies and businesses timely and official. I've been informed that the office space of the registrar is too small and unfit for the attainment of the objects of the office. The assistance of the Attorney General, two acres of land have been acquired within the premises of the University of Ghana for the construction of a new office building. The Registrar of Companies will carry out his duties in this new space and you assume all there also the functions of the official liquidator under the Corporate Insolvency and Restructuring Act 2020 Act 1015. <laughs> I think Pam Musica Samon Contebu, mid year budget review 2022, or the best to draw our Ghana, Master Bridget. Honorable members are encouraged to avail themselves for this presentation. Mr. Speaker, since one of our bona fides is to debate, this statement will be debated and we encourage members to do the necessary research, come with facts and figures for us to have a healthy debate without personalizing and trivializing issues. We encourage to debate on this matter in the best interest of our nation. Mr. Speaker, the business committee proposes that the leadership of the committees, of the caucuses, structure the debate along specific sectors. So for instance, governance, security, public safety, finance, economy generally, energy, infrastructure, etc., etc., should be the approach so that members can focus on specific areas. So when we know it's on a Greek and Honorable Eric Opoku is on his feet, we know that he's going to deal with all the issues regarding the successes job by the government on Agric, whilst some uh, fallout would also be, uh, would be, would be argued, you know. So, Mr. Speaker, that is expected. Sitting time and extended sitting, Mr. Speaker, we expect to be sitting at 10 a.m. and uh, we encourage members to be in the chamber on time. Na NDC amanyokuo no wo mu ayen sentrofo enhia mudie nam so e matwotrofo pani ya udi amanyokuo no anim eye Uwra Johnson asidu nketia ye general mosquito akasa na nasema a woka nyina ne se atemu adwumakuo e wo mai ganam no 
sisi ya oman yi mupa ni jidi ya mapapaya gana fo ewo wo munu abafo mkra. No reasons assigned for judgments and rulings. One disa disappointing, if not scandalous development that is likely to make our justice system the butt of jokes among other democracies in Africa and the world at large is the phenomenon of court judgments without reasons. In recent times, our Supreme Court has handed down some judgments and rulings that do not make any legal or factual sense because the court has failed to assign any reasons for these judgments. Two examples will suffice. It is instructive to note that in the recent case of Abdul Malik Kwakubako versus the Attorney General, suit number J1 stroke 225 stroke 2018, which had raised certain important constitutional questions about the impeachment proceedings of Mrs. Charlotte Osei, the chairperson, the then chairperson of the Electoral Commission. The Apex Court simply declared, without any reason, that, quote, after listening to counsel in the matter on the question whether the instant action is a proper invocation of our original jurisdiction, and also having regard to the processes filed in this matter, we are of the view that the action does not raise any issue of interpretation or enforcement. Accordingly, we strike out the action, which in our view is unmeritorious. The NDC is also greatly concerned about the unholy haste of the Apex Court in trespassing into domains reserved for the legislature by the 1992 Constitution. We note that one entrenched principle of our legal governance since 1993 has been the recognition by our courts that it is not their business to get into certain matters that by law have been assigned to other branches of government. Contrary to this principle, we have observed a creeping tendency of the APS court to trespass into domains reserved for parliament. In the process, the court has demonstrated legal or constitutional hubris and thrown overboard the restraints the court has exercised in the past over matters that fall within the domain of the parliament of the Republic of Ghana. On swap for a bit, the HR Hermesia on Sam's Reverend John in Tim for Joe, or call a pro or head of his back press printing house. Hey, Ben of Uncle, now a new mono, and Wobo Abasso said, said the more printing woman, or my hair, or shimmer, best or handsome edusia, or my own jimmer. Send a banner, you shine at the children who send between my father and to my pa, a dear friend of my gun and Montino, a buying iron, said test books, I never made you for no dear shanty, you know. Companies were printed test books, oh my gun and moo, or one ancient one printy, no concoop, you moo, a wabruchiri. Nasadu, my dear in tea, and also offer by the child, so I read you on some swore. On my young for Reverend John in team for job one nine. I walk up here where you may come back on a moo, back press. I walk over here, you may dear nico, and nothing pimpers, so I test books or print and all. I walk up drew. Then what you know, and on my young for an and trail for your chunk of more in a wood to the moor. Now, Baby, who know what you're in the pa. You may dear no echo one, no one. As for the Nibua, Bess said, You may dear no more how much you would you see a sixty per cent a year, a idea with ye. I ain't a piano, or Bess, I say, I tell me, Bianco school be a moo. Now, Boma, you send on the chair on summer to my father and to my pa, a dear fra. I buy you the quality of job. Or my printing, we have in Fidia, Cassia, Cassia, who do one, a book, wa, 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 and ten to one, a printing, now share quality, no, now share finishing, no. Now, sir, Genesia, I'm penny, and then the swap for him, Miss Yanso, a CS, Yam Penty or Ghana Hano, Nazi, a Dimuan Casa, as they would Gidius Runco, a Wagana for Musa, Yeni Abbot to Miae, Sansa, Genesia, and Fasu, Debbie, and the Diaba, Sansa, 
print houses no be fa Ghana fo be bre e mo mo ayese adwuma yi enti no ankra ankro be nya sika e na e fie fie enso e fie fie zo be yi sanso e na di infa so e be ba bia anso no e be ka ha wo betua ho tax e mu o ha mu ntitima di osia de wo ma print e bi kura deliver the code da enti ni e hu ha e ka kra bi aka enso ne ya wo ma be fa e di akro various regions na regions ne so achye dia ma school fo no and na kakra nso a wo nso eguso a wo mo e print e wo fide ni mu a mo twa ho fo ni wo mo asa se e bo se hwe speed a wo mo kwa ani fide akese akese o mo e wo ha na se 90 days ne kra na e de ma wo mo contract ni mu no wo mo kra be di su kra mpo ma enta se nru ho no no ma to mo nsa e fi adwuma ne ho no so fo ne ka se chire no e no opinion na back press o da no se executive director francis nyani en so e ka sa no wutire mu a juma di aban e dia se wonsa no o hwe ni mu se science textbooks o be print ba ko ba ko 1 million e o ha mu chiche mu adusi 60% de e ya de wa wie gana post complete limited adwuma e ko no na be hwe hu ni se o be che textbooks no e dia ko my gana fana be bia e print o pepe ba ko 1 million and since now I didn't come, I think or how much you move at the scene. The printing we are now. The idea is that I can buy boxes. Now the share boxes now. Now I buy my money. No more far. No more the car. So the move here and there. I'm going to carry this here. I'm going to buy a car. The share I buy boss. Any minister now boss. The car no. You bet me. I print it. I'm going to hold the car. So be ya. And so every time I do my own pull no. Now I print it here. I will see a for Muguswa every you to non rubri mukasia boba be a ye dri ye betra ye mwa kwaje n kato a ba ye ba a fiat rebet nas and a pam for a pichon ko mo a fa a ye disi ya won sem ewa my gana mti mean kobia ye try ye hon abasisia.